Please note if you are using Capture One 21 version 14.3 or newer, Capture One has completely removed everything to do with processing and merged it into the export tool. So just use the export tab to work with your export recipes, which were formerly known as process recipes. Otherwise, if you're using Capture One 21 version 14.2 or older, this video still applies to you. Enjoy. Getting your images out of Capture One by exporting or processing can be a bit confusing. In this headshot method, quick tip, I'm gonna explain the differences between them and which one I think is best to use. Exporting images, including JPEGs, TIFFs, DNG, PSD, and PNG files from your raw files is pretty much the same as processing images. The big difference is processing uh, it can happen in the background and it's not all up in your face. Stop what you're doing, cover up what you're working on. Processing is perfect for getting your images out of Capture One and over to a folder, an image sharing station, or maybe even a live slideshow with just a hotkey. If you need more than one version of an image, you can even create and select multiple process recipes to work at the same time. Now exporting, on the other hand, it's slower, it covers up what you're working on and it interrupts your workflow. This is why we always process images instead of export them. In other headshot method quick tip videos, I share how to create some killer process recipes for online use as well as client delivery. So the next time you wanna create a JPEG, or a TIFF, you're probably gonna to wanna to process instead of export.